I like this episode a lot better than the last episode, and that is saying something, because I had a good kick out of the last episode of Denki Guy. This episode has some very, very weird comedy, but it was definitely something that made me laugh. The first half of this episode, at first it starts off slow. You have the entire, you know, shop just have to get together and start up for a midnight release of a certain volume of a series. And you see how everything gets hectic and all that. And then after that, they go to a restaurant. And that's when things really start to get interesting in this episode. Foo Girl is best girl. I, I thought Sensei was best girl of this series. No, it, it most likely is Foo Girl because after her entire character personality reveal in this episode, she's not just a standard lolly character. She's not. She's not a standard moe lolly character that is perverted. No, she actually believes everything is zombies pretty much. That's exactly what we see in this episode like she imagines and thinks about zombies almost 24 7 and she was looking at umio our main male character as the perfect zombie candidate for her makeup dressed him up as a fucking zombie and then was going to beat him with a metal baseball bat to have some zombie practice training that right there i'm like whoa I was laughing so freaking hard when I saw scenes like that. I was like, what the fuck? He looks so creepy as a zombie. He looks so freaking creepy. And then when she went, like, beast mode, starting to try to beat the shit out of him, I'm like, oh... Oh my god. So with this episode, truly what you could see from it, it seems like Somere is falling in love with Foo Girl. That's what I'm seeing in this episode. I was getting those type of romance vibes between it, or as a protective father type vibe. One of the two I'm getting from Somere and, you know, Foo Girl. That's the only thing I'm getting off of them, and that was really what the main focus of this episode was on. I mean, you can get a lot of comedy out of this episode with the different characters and the events that go on in it, but the main, I guess, overall plot that progressed in this with the characters is Somere and Foo Girl, you know, looks like they're having some form of connection or bond at the end of this episode. And so I felt like this episode was a very enjoyable episode, and it retained that consistent Moe animation quality it had from the first episode. The music was good, once again, for this type of series, and I felt like the comedy was just freaking funny. Oh my god. If I had to say my favorite part about the episode when it comes in terms of comedy, I think it would be those overdramatic twitches. Like, the, the fucking twitches that the girls did when they got shot by the water. Like, Foo Girl when she gets shot by Sensei, she's like, like that, I'm like, the way she got, like, shot at, and the way she's like, Nee! It was so funny, oh my god, it was so cute, adorable, and I was just laughing at it, but it, it's definitely a funny series, it's, it's really funny, and I enjoyed it for the most part. Sad thing is, Sensei wasn't used much in this episode, I mean, she barely appeared at all, and when she was in it, she only had a couple lines, and then she pretty much disappeared. So, it's upsetting to see that she didn't have a big role in this episode, maybe she might move back into the best girl title if we go into the next episode, but either way, right now, Foo Girl is definitely best girl. Oh yes, one thing I do want to talk about about this series is the competitions, like the weird competitions, like really fucking wacky and weird, it makes me question like, oh my god, I'd, I'd be very freaking embarrassed too if I had to do competition, like, you know, just different games like that in a competition. There was a competition where the guys had to run down a busy street of Japan, or Tokyo, wherever, and they had to grab fucking pansu with their mouse they had to grab a bunch of jump up grab it and start running down the fucking street i'm like what the fuck kind of game is that like what the fuck and the other will have like a pansu had i'm like okay <laughs> just like okay i'm going with it i've seen weirder i have so i mean hey let's roll with it it's a very funny episode. If you've yet to go watch it, go give it a shot because you'll most likely laugh. And tell me your thoughts in the comments below. What was your favorite moment about this episode of Dinky Guy? Did you enjoy it? Did you hate it? What did you feel about it? Do you feel like the comedy was a lot better than the first episode? Or do you feel like the comedy was a lot worse than the first episode? Let me know also. Love you all so much. Please be safe. Chibi out.